All right, hello, and it's Silver Kyle, and today we are going to be taking a look at the Sea of Stars Early Backer Limited Edition by Limited Run. And this is something that as soon as it was announced, I wanted a physical copy of this because this is a throwback to the Super Nintendo era of turn-based RPGs. And usually I don't really like indie games. Uh, unless that they're RPGs, then there's a chance. And this one, as soon as I saw the first trailer for it, I fell completely in love with it. This looks exactly what I want. If, if you're going to have an old school game, this is it. And if you're going to throw back to the Super Nintendo era, how can you want more from this like collector's edition, limited edition? It's It looks exactly like a Super Nintendo game. So let's dive in and take a look at what's included here. Uh, let's go over here to make a small puncture. And I've been waiting patiently for this edition because the game came out physically, I think last year. And I was like, nope, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait until I can get the physical copy. Cause they had announced it like almost right away. I feel, or not long after, I don't think. Even the colors here, like the little purple strand and the pink, I like that. So now we get a much clearer look of what this looks like. Sea of Stars and Sabotage. Nintendo Switch and Sea of Stars, limited run. And you can kind of see a little bit about what the game looks like. I mean, these images don't do it justice, but it very much, even this purple here, nice throwback really to what um, the SNES games were like. We can take this guy off, put that over here. It's kind of the same thing. I'm gonna open it. I don't want to, oof, that opened up beautifully. No creases at all, that's always good to see. I'll take out everything that's included. That's something that I feel a lot of games are doing now, is these stands. I won't put it together, because uh, it'll take too long to do so. But uh, these are cool, they're not my favorite, but they're a nice little addition. If, you're, if they're not gonna throw in anything else, I mean, I'd rather have that at least. Then we've got the soundtrack. I kind of give you an indication of the songs in the back here. That's something that I really enjoyed from the trailers of this game so far, have been the uh, score. It just sounds so good. We've got a little pin, that's nice. That's cool. Then we've got, okay, that's just holding stuff together. And then the game itself. There, we got it. Okay, well, let's open it up first then. Stars. Embark on a journey on, of peril and wonder as a sol uh, as a solst as a solstice warrior in this turn-based RPG inspired by the classics. We get a little bit of a look. Like these images don't do it justice. You definitely have to actually look at the trailer. And this is kind of cool. The disc is fine. I mean, that's the. It's okay. The cartridge is okay. I was kind of expecting a little bit more. That looks really nice, though. The Switch has gotten so many. I mean, it's crazy to think about how many RPGs are on the Switch. This looks like it's two sided. Side. Same thing, just different colors, daytime and nighttime. So 
there you have it. That is the Sea of Stars. I cannot wait to try this out for the first time because I've been avoiding it since the beginning. Uh, and go from there. I really hope that it, it plays well and that we get more uh, from the studio because I've never heard of them before. Uh, this game, it's entirely pop. I don't know if this is their first game. No idea about them. I just saw this and I was like, I need that game. So there you have it. Sea of Stars limited, uh, early backer limited edition by Limited Run. Thank you all for watching. You have been bearded in. Beardage.